Hi. This is this is Grandpa Jim. Hi. Hello to all you Putneys and Estrans out there. I want to talk about Rosh Hashanah and Yom Kippur and another important aspect, receiving the Torah. Now I have a question for you and big get to know the answer. Hold off, wait a minute. The question is, when did we receive the Torah? I'll give you some choices. Did we receive the Torah on Shavuos? Right? 49 days of counting the Omer. And then on the 50th, we celebrate receiving the Torah. Or, is it Simchat Torah, the last day of Sukkot, when we dance around and celebrate receiving the Torah? The answer to both of those is sort of yes and no. I'll go through it now, step by step. The 6th of Sivan is Shavuos. It's also the day that in the desert, the children of Israel approached Har Sinai and Hashem spoke the Sarasaduros, the Ten Commandments, to the Jewish people. The next day, Moshe went up onto the mountain, 7th of Sivan. And he stayed there 40 days. And then Hashem gave him the Torah. And he came down with the Torah. But he saw that the people were dancing with a golden calf. Bad. And so Moshe threw the Luchos, the Torah, and broke them. Now he had to get Hashem to forgive the Jewish people. So on the 19th of Tammuz, he went back up, stayed for another 40 days, and then he came down on the 29th of Av and told the people that Hashem had forgiven them. But they still don't have the Torah. So he went back up again on the first day of Elul, the month we're in right now. Stayed there another 40 days. And then he came down on the 10th of Tishrei. That's Yom Kippur. That's the day we received the, the complete Torah that we have today. So we celebrate on Simchat Torah and we celebrate on Shavuot. But the actual giving of the Torah was on Yom Kippur. A lot of going up and down for Moshe. Now, an important thing about these 40 and 30 days of Elul, the month of Elul, is they say that on the 30 days, the month of Elul, that the king is in the field. This is not a drawing of anything but a make-believe king. Imagine a king is in the field, you can run out to him and you can say, Hey king, I have a question for this. Uh, why don't you forgive me for this? Uh, I want to do this, I want to help me do this better. Hashem, in these 30 days available, and we have three days left, is eager to help us. And there's a principle in Torah that who wants to do better, heaven will help him. So all you have to do is, in these last few days and leading up to Rosh Hashanah and through the next Monday is to say, Hashem, I really want to do better. I want to grow as a Jew. I want to learn more Torah. I want to be nicer to my parents or whatever you need to do. Hashem will hear you and he will help you. That's a pretty good deal. So now, when did Hashem give us the Torah that we came down and Moshe gave it to us? Yom Kippur. Shana, Shana Tova. Happy New Year. Love you all. Bye.